Shalom. I want to start off by giving all honor, praise, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakar Kodash. Double honors to our elders and apostles for teaching us the truth to this Bible. And Shalom to you, I keep pushing this truth with the hopes of being saved from this coming destruction. You know what the Spirit just wants to go on a quick lesson on, you know, for us brothers who, who live with our parents, you know, it's, hey, man, hey, we gotta, we gotta get the hell up out of there, you know, and that's not just, uh, you understand, you know, like, like when you get the, uh, when Mosai, you know, puts the spirit in men, you know, a brother to tell you, hey, you know, you gotta, uh, you know, you gotta get up out that house, you know, you gotta, uh, get your own place, you know, it's, 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 it's not a, uh, you know, at first you're thinking, damn, I gotta, I gotta hurry up and do it, you know, it's, it's pretty much a process, you know, the most high gives you a, a period of time, however, you know, however long he sees fit, you know, to pretty much, cause like the scripture says, you know, he will give every needful thing in due season, you know, you gotta, uh, you know, and, and, and us brothers, we have, we have to work, you know, cause we don't, we don't work, we don't eat, you know, we, we have to, uh, you know, get from point, we need cars, you know, we got to get from point A to point B, you know, how are you going to do that without money, you know, how are you going to pay gas, you know, toll, whatever it is, you know, so, you know, it's, it's not a thing of, okay, uh, okay, I got to hurry up and do this, you know, it's just a thing, it's, it, it takes time, you know, whenever the most high sees fit for you to, us to move out, you know, it is that, uh, it's that time, you know, but, but in the meantime, you know, it's, it's about, uh, you know, build it, build try to build up your credit, you know, try to build your credit up, you know, cause this place may not, this place may not last another, uh, three, four years or whatnot, you know, but, but while we're here, we got to, uh, we have to, you know, build, build some type of credit, you know, cause you're going to need credit in order to, to get a place, you know, and uh let's start off with this scripture right here. This is uh his Ecclesiastes seven and twelve. For wisdom is a defense and money is a defense. But the ecstasy of knowledge is that wisdom giveth life to them that have it. You know? So wisdom is a defense, you know. Wisdom is, is, is going to what's going to keep us stable in the times that come. You know, it's keeping us stable in the the, the little hell that we catching right now. You know, but uh, the money, you know, the, this what you can do in the meantime. You know, is try to save up money. You know, try to build your credit up. And and, and, and uh, like I said, it's, it's not going to be an overnight process, but. It's like it's not going to be an overnight thing, you know. You're just going to instantly just jump out and just move out, you know. Don't be simple. But in the meantime, you know, most I give you that time to try to save money. You know, that's that's why, you know, working working comes in handy. You know, so like your working is, is very important, you know. Try to save your money, you know, not spend right, rightlessly, you know, just just. On all types of folly like these people, you know, putting yourself in debt. But that money is is defense, you know. Because then, say something happens to where you might get kicked out of your house, you know. You have that money in order to, to, to lean on, you know, to help you uh, get out. Let's see. Uh, but but uh, pretty much, you know. You you living with your your parent us living with our parents or whatever you know, you have uh, you know it is it's a bunch of demons running in that house, you know your uh your family members, you know that they uh already you try to tell them about the truth, you know, and they don't even want to accept the 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 simple the simplest thing you know is that they're Israelite they don't even want to accept that, you know you may tell somebody. You may tell somebody, uh, uh, you know, oh, uh, in your family that they're Israelite, you know, and you tell them about the curses of Deuteronomy 28, you know, because it's plain to you, but then they come up and say, oh, uh, you know, oh, I'm not, I'm not cursed, you know, I'm, I'm blessed, you know, because they believe in that damn Christian doctrine that Esau taught them, you know, hey, that's, that's, that's straight up, 
straight up demons, man. You know, and ultimately, you know, Satan is 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 uh running through them to try to try to uh hinder us in this truth. You know, that's a that's why we gotta you have to move out of your parents' house. You know, when the Most High sees fit. You know, continue stacking that money. Continue building your credit. You know, looking for a place. And, and, and uh, trying to make that move, you know, the necessary steps in that process. But, uh, let's see, uh, so like the scripture I want to bring out is, uh, this is uh, Amos 3 and 3. Can two walk together except they be agreed? You know, so scriptures, you may live with your parents, you know, the scriptures say to, to honor thy mother and thy father. You know, don't uh, curse them out and, and, and crap like that, you know. But at the same time, you know, don't uh, don't try to, to uh, you know, fall to their, you know, they didn't make sale, celebrate holidays and stuff. Don't try to fall to that. Don't try to, uh, to uh, do that to please them, you know. So let's, let's bring this out real quick. It's Jeremiah 2 and 33. Why trimmest thou thy way to seek love? You know? Why don't don't trim your way to seek love? You know? The way is uh the way, the way, you know, is following Yahweh by Shemel Shine, following these commandments, you know, and not uh like the scriptures say, not to, to follow the ways of the heathen, you know, celebrating these vain customs, man. You know, Christmas, Thanksgiving, Halloween, you know, uh Easter, you know, damn uh what is a uh, Valentine's Day, you know, stuff like that, you know, hey, uh, one that just passed, uh, what was it, Memorial Day, Labor Day, Memorial Day, you know, all these type of, uh, of, uh, you know, vain customs, or vain holidays and stuff that, that, that Esau, you know, but has uh, our people following, we're not to follow those things, man, you know, Living with your family, you know, your your, your family, they're going to, uh, Satan's going to run all through them to basically try to get you to go off, you know. Oh, what, what, this, this piece of ham ain't good enough for you no more, you know. You done changed up and blah, 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 you know. Those are, are, are key indicators. Okay, uh, a wise man will say, I, I got to get the hell up out of here, you know. You know, ultimately... You may not have enough to get out at the time or not. You know, you pray to Yahweh Shemel Shai to help you endure through that. You know, because like I said, the most I give every needful thing in due season. You know, but we got to uh, yeah, stomach that. In the meantime, you know, like I said, don't uh, don't eat the, the glazed ham on Thanksgiving to try to please, try to please Big Mama, you know. At the Thanksgiving party or whatnot, you know. But then, hey man, that's more uh, fuel for you to be like, I, I gotta get the hell up out of here, you know. But this is uh, Exodus 23 and 2 Thou shalt not follow a multitude to do evil, neither shalt thou speak in a cause to decline after many to rest judgment, you know. So we're not to follow a multitude to do evil, man. So our people. And multitudes and droves, man, just just celebrate these damn holidays, man. Worshiping these damn idols. And you know, we're not to, to follow that, man. You know, we're following how about Shmiel Shai. So just because you, you know, you may live under... <coughs> so, <like you. coughs> so just because you may live under the roof, you know, of your parents or whatnot, you know, you got to... That doesn't mean you just, oh, I got to, uh, I got to follow follow uh their customs you know celebrating that stuff and all that that's that's part of old man you know we all celebrate that crap back in the day you know get christmas presents and, and you know all that all that stuff man but that stuff we're supposed to put away man put off that old man you know that's not pleasing to y'all but you know shy want to grab uh let's see it's just a quick lesson to spirit you want to go through. 
You know, cause the scriptures say to uh, to use the world is not abusing it too. You know. That's lucky. This is uh. Second Corinthians six and fourteen. Be not unequally yoked together with unbelievers. For what fellowship have righteousness with unrighteousness? And what communion hath light with darkness? You know? So you may have like this this family member you know, that you look up to or whatever whatnot, you know, that you live with. In the meantime, well, you know, while you're saving, you're trying to do what you gotta do, you know, to get up out of there. And you uh you may have a family member that you look up to. You know, who, uh, you know, always, who smoke weed or, or, who smokes weed or, or whatever he, he does, you know. And yeah, you got to kind of, uh, just because you live under the, the same roof or whatnot, you got to kind of separate yourself from this person, you know. If, and, and examine yourself and see, hey, you know, do, do I have that, uh, like yeah. and pretty much be like hey do i have that do i look up to this person do i have that uh what do you call that uh admiration or you know for this person you know so i kind of uh, get swayed when this person comes around you know examine yourself and then say okay okay i gotta uh maybe i gotta keep it my distance from this person you know and, and, and hey, uh, try to fellowship with like a, a brother or something instead of that, you know, because we're, uh, we're, uh, we're not, uh, we're not of this world, you know, and our family members, you know, I, I have plenty of family members, all my family members, you know, are of this world, you know, wonder how come you don't want to watch the game with them, or you don't want to watch, uh, basketball football anymore you know all you say is rigged you uh something's wrong with you you know all that type of stuff man you know the spirit i don't i don't really uh my spirit i don't really mess with my family you know because like how shy said you know the 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 uh my real brothers my real sister you know my real family you know are those that do the will y'all by shmeo shy you know man man my wicked ass family ain't doing that you know, my brother, uh, my brothers, my family, you know, or the, the brothers who who's in this truth, you know, who's pushing this word, who's, tr hey, uh, catching the same tribulations in hell that I'm catching, you know, that's uh, trying to follow the commandments to the best of their ability, you know, as, as I am, you know, and those, those are the, uh, the ones I, you know, I fellowship with. You know, those are the ones we're to, to be fellowshipping with, you know, because it's like scripture says, iron sharpeneth iron. You know, only the only thing these to, these people can do, man, is, is sharpen you with more wickedness, sharpen you in, in worldly things, you know, things that are vain and just not profitable, you know. So I want to end it off with this. So this is a. Uh, let me see, uh, Slack. Oh, so this is, uh, St. Matthew's 10 and 34. And this is how was shy speaking. And also this is, think not that I've come to send peace on the earth. I came not to send peace, but a sword. You know, so we, we understand that, that no peace is coming to this place, you know. And when all hell breaks loose, who these people that we, we uh, who these people are gonna, that we live with gonna going to turn to, you know. Who are they going to, uh, whose side are they going to be on? So it says, for am, I am come to set a man at variance against his father and the daughter against her mother and the daughter-in-law against her mother-in-law. And a man's foes shall be though they of his own household, you know. So the a, hey, like I said, with all we were to to honor our mother and father, you know, you know. 
that's pleasing to the most high, you still got to have in your mind that, you know, them, you know, your, 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 uh, your sister, your brother, what, whoever you live with, you know, is, is our, is pretty much our, 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 fo our foes, you know, our, our, they're, 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 uh, let's read it again, slack here. It says, and a man's foes shall be those, they of his own household, you know? So, yeah, we're to, uh, to honor our mother and father at all, you know? But we're, uh, at the end of the day, we got to understand that they're not about this truth. They're not for this truth, you know? They could give a, they don't give a damn about this truth, you know? They, they, uh, they still, hey, they still believe in, in Esau, you know? They still hearing this, want to hear the smooth words, you know? They don't give a damn. They they believe that the law, statutes, and commandments are done with. You know. They they uh. As uh, what was it uh, scripture. Um. So lucky. You know they they're pretty much with this world, man. You know. And you know, like the scriptures say that uh, those who are friends with this world, you know, are pretty much enemies of the Most High. You know, so we we gotta understand once all hell breaks loose, who who they're gonna who who our family's gonna go go against. You know, they gonna go against us. You know, oh I never liked him anyway. You know, uh, he's always talking that damn Bible talk and what I I need to do and what I don't need to do and what I need to eat and all that. You know, hey they gonna they gonna go up against us, man. You know. All these people's true colors gonna come out when all hell breaks loose, man. And uh, when, when Esau, you know, when Esau, uh, they might might put a a price out, you know, like, oh, hey, uh, this this man, you know, we're we're looking for this man, you know. Esau might come to your family member and and and, and be like, hey, we'll we'll give you some money, you know. Hey, uh, try to give him the chip, you know. But we'll put this much money on there, you know. If you give your son up, you know, and they'll, they'll, they'll quickly do it, you know, because they, they believe in this world. They believe this place is going to continue, you know, they see no, they, 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 they have no hope, you know, they have no, no faith that this, this stuff is actually going to go down. These things are actually going to go down, you know, so it says he that loveth father or mother more than me is not worthy of me. And he that loves his son or daughter more than me is not worthy of me. You know, I said, you know, it's a balance. You know, you use the world as not abusing it. You know, you uh, honor mother and father, but don't, you ain't got to uh, be around them 24-7, you know. Being around them 24-7 and, and, and uh, like I was going into earlier, doing the things they do, celebrating these damn holidays to try to, to to please them you know this is uh what is it uh and he that take it not his cross and followeth after me is not worthy of me you know so we gotta take up our cross daily and he that findeth his life shall lose it and he that loses his life for my sake shall find it you know so you put this the way it is uh, this world away Celebrating these bullshit holidays, you know, and, and, and all this, this, this worldly crap, you know, at the end of the day, you're going to find life, man. You know, this, this word, this word is life, you know, scripture that says, uh, basically that, uh, the flesh profited nothing, but the spirit is, 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 uh, so lucky. Let's grab that. It's St. John 6 and 63. It is a spirit that quicken it, you know. Quicken it meaning to make alive. You know. The flesh profited nothing. The words that I speak unto you, they are spirit and they are life. You know. So you gain this word. You know how Shai gives you, Yahweh Shemel Shai gives you this, this word. This is, this is, this now becomes your life. This now becomes our life. 
you know not the ways of this world trying to please these damn people man you know like i said in the meantime stack your money gain your uh boost your credit you know and, and uh you know pretty much uh hey man try to be as separate as possible from these these people you know Say the Wadi Al Bashmil Shai for putting the Holy Spirit to call Kodash on me to do this lesson. The honors for elders and apostles for teaching us the truth of this Bible. And shall want you, I can push this truth with the hopes of being saved from the coming destruction. Shall want.